The White House response to Russia was quite different in the last administration. Talk to us about it. Yeah, it, it was very different, Harris, uh, which is why you didn't see what is happening now on Trump's watch. I mean, there were so many sanctions put in place. There were almost, almost no sanctions left. Uh, there was a consulate that was expelled. Russia had no diplomatic presence on our West Coast. I mean, these were clear signs to Putin you will not mess around. And Harris, I'm just incensed by the soundbite that I saw on your program uh, less than an hour ago, where you heard that deputy national security advisor say, quote, this is the beginning of the latest mm -hmm. Russian invasion of Ukraine. Uh, he's been doing this since 2014. Excuse me, there were four years where he didn't do this going back to 2014. That was when President Donald Trump was in power. The real truth here is this, that there is no greater supporter of the Democrat Party than Vladimir Putin, because he got Crimea on Obama's watch, and now he's getting exactly what he wants on Joe Biden's watch. As his, his minions go out onto the airwaves, refuse to call it an invasion, it took nearly a day. His advisor was twisting in the wind as CNN was trying to get him to utter the word invasion. And then reporting that this action may not alone merit the type of severe sanctions that Biden's been warning about that should have been in place yeah, where are before they? all of this. Yes, the, the bottom line is this, Harris. Uh, two embassies evacuated in one year of Biden. Two countries gone, essentially, in one year of Biden. That is all you need to know.